Hello YouTube, it's Grosama, and here we have today is the high grade Mazinger Z Infinity version. Now with this kit, I overall loved it in my review. Pretty much a lot of good points on here. Uh, details, the overall design of it, the accessories, pretty awesome. The only thing I really had an issue with was probably going to be the articulation. Uh, maybe just the posability is very, very limited. Nonetheless, it's still a very solid kit overall. But in this video, I want to showcase three different poses, much like I do every single pose video. So without further ado, let's begin with the first pose. And here's the first pose. Overall, I just want to use these little missiles that are stored in the elbow. Now this is an extra little piece as you've seen in the little montage, but it looks super, super cool. And I want to go and basically kind of widen out these legs as much as I can. But the thing is like, they don't really lie that flat. It, maybe you can get one to lie flat, but getting both of them to essentially be on the ground uh, pretty much flat is going to be a, a task nonetheless. However, it still looks really good overall, and I love this type of pose. It's just, it's super, super robot, in my opinion. Uh, just having like all these little kind of crazy antic poses that would never exist in a, you know, real mecha anime. Uh, but yeah, nonetheless, it looks really good. So without further ado, let's go ahead and move on to the second pose. And here is the second pose. So utilizing the axes on the arm, I, I really wish it had another like, um, uh, what I call is basically like a salute hand or a knife hand uh, for the left hand. It just doesn't, it only has it for the right side. And I just, I want double karate chop. That's, that's all I wanted. So kind of disappointed in that, but nonetheless, it still looks really good. Um, you know, I'm just trying to stick to these ground poses because I, Although the Mazinga does come with the uh, the flight pack, it just doesn't, I don't know, it doesn't do it for me. So I'm trying to keep a lot of these poses on the ground, which I think most people are probably going to utilize. Uh, but this does come with a stand, so maybe in another time I'll, sh I'll showcase some more uh, poses that are actually on the stand. But if you want to see some of those, you can definitely you know check out my review, and I do uh, put a couple of the aerial poses into effect. But let's, let's go ahead and move forward to the third and final pose. And here is the third and final pose. So overall, I do really like this one. I, I love poses that are kind of like shooting backwards and just getting ready to, you know, land an attack or you know, fire off attack. It looks pretty cool. And I went ahead and used the um, the backpack, you know, just for added effect because I figure it's going to be flying anyways, and it's kind of like thrusting backwards and um, you know, just shoots off its arm and you know, hits a couple of enemies, brings the arm right back, and keeps on flying. Uh, that's just the thought process I had when I was doing the third and final pose. Uh, so it looks pretty good, but you know, like I mentioned before, uh, y'all can always go ahead and just do whatever poses y'all really feel is necessary for your collection. Uh, but yeah, I generally just do these to add a little bit of inspiration for y'all. Uh, but yeah, if you do like this pose, let me know in the comment section below. If it's not really a pose that you really enjoy, let me know as well. Maybe there's some other poses that 
you would have preferred or you know you would have liked to seen um, but nonetheless I do enjoy this one if you yeah, do have some poses of your own that you want to go ahead and show me uh, just go ahead and link into like uh, tag me in Twitter so I can go ahead and see him because uh, I know YouTube the community tab doesn't allow you know y'all post some pictures uh, but definitely communicate with me on Twitter because that's like the best you know social media platform I have as of right now but nonetheless Definitely appreciate y'all for watching, and like always, definitely rate, comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll be seeing y'all in the next review. Bye-bye.